Boom, boom. So there's an interesting fact coming up. If if you drive into a certain area here, which, which you actually kind of need to do, Gagagi Gandhi, the buggy will break down, forcing you to, to, to go to the next town, which we do want to go to, but you don't want to have your buggy break down, otherwise we, we, we won't be able to do the next uh, Fort Condor battle. So... It's kind of re recommended to kind of not get too close to it. Aww, I can't ma manipulate the jerk. Death blow I missed, of course. Most of the time it's probably going to miss. That's just the way it goes. Ba, ba, ba. Stole soft. Yeah, so you can steal softs. Which it which isn't really a big deal, but there it is. Manipulate! Death blow worked and that's a one shot. They're both petrified, so we need to do White Wind. There you go. And we can do Fury Brand, because why the F not? You know what I'm talking about? Boom! Get some more limits going. It's good stuff. Bam! Wow, didn't finish either of them. That's kind of psychotic. Blade Beam! There we are. Do 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 do. That's a pretty nice fight, I would say. And of course, once we get to the next town, we're definitely going to have to do some farming for money to get the best equipment. I usually spend a while doing that, so that'll be exciting. Ski Ski! Ladies and gentlemen, it's Ski Ski! 540 HP. So basically they have an attack that that has a chance of doing a crit. Uh, otherwise it doesn't hurt very much. Pretty much how that works. Goodbye, sirs, but they're not really of much consequence. Just like Bonga. 666 experience, imagine that. And 666 gill. Alright, so we're going to park our buggy here. Otherwise, if you drive past here, it, it, it'll break down. Forcing you to uh, go here and you'll kind of be stuck and it won't be fun. And yeah. That's just the way it, it'll be. Okay. So if you want to go on a date with Barrett later on, it's a good idea to put him in your party before you come in here, but I'm not going to worry about that. I'm not going to worry about that nonsense. It's Cosmo Canyon. I am home. It is I, Nanaki. Nanaki. Hey, Nanaki, you're safe. Come on and say, and say hello to Bugenhagen, which is of course a reference to Copenhagen. I mean, come on, man. 
Who are you trying to fool? Nanaki? Why? Red seems different, doesn't he? Welcome to Cosmo Canyon. Are you familiar with this land? No. Let me explain. People from all over the world gather here to seek the study of planet life. Mga. What? Mga. What the hell does that mean? I don't know. I'm sorry it's full now, so I can't let you enter. That's a shame. They helped me when I was on the road. Please let them in. Oh, is that so? You helped our Nanaki. Please, come in. Cool. Bum, bum, bum. Who is Nanaki? Nanaki is Nanaki. That's his name. Interesting. So basically, if you want to date Barrett, you have to raise his his uh, uh, affection towards Cloud. And there's a little trick here where you can do that infinitely. If 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 you want, you gotta find him in the weapon shop, and you can just keep talking to him, and then re re, re, re keep re-entering the room and keep talking to him until until till he has the most affection. But I'm really not too worried about that, so it doesn't really matter. But yeah. Welcome to Cosmo Canyon. Make yourselves at home. So we can take a look around this place. Hang out. So this is Cosmo Canyon. Quite a mysterious place. Have you come to seek the study of planet life? No. Oh, really? There really isn't much else to see here. Hmm. Yeah? I heard there's an awesome observatory here. I'd like to see it if I have a chance. So I think that's the guy, if you have your buggy breakdown, he'll actually fix it for you. But it takes a while, so you got to go through the events here, and yeah. Yay, Nanaki! Nanaki's back! It's all thanks to this flame! This fire is called Cosmo Candle. It has burned for generations. It is a holy flame that protects this canyon. I've heard it only went out once, long ago. The Elder said something horrifying occurred, but I really don't know much else about it. Oh, that... That takes me back to Ark the Lad. So there's a ladder here, but it goes nowhere. It goes to a little platform with boxes on it, I guess. Like a little storage thing. Not much you can do. Na -na 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 -na. Let's see what's going on in here. Pub Starlet. How's it going? Elder Bug. Is that so? You brought Nanaki back here. Yeah, thanks. Okay. Welcome. How about our original cocktail, Cosmo Candle? A drink now and then is good for you. It'll relax you a bit, if you know when to stop. That's a big if. What is this? Random Path. So this takes you to a little, uh, it, it's actually Nanaki's room, believe it or not. I don't know why his, his, I don't know why his room is in the back of the bar, but okay. Sure, why not? Welcome to Shildra Inn. It'll be a hundred gill a night. Would you like to stay? Nah, it's all right. Well then, please come again. And of course, over here. Turtles Paradise number five. Our cocktails are good, but our wine is the best. Please stop in the in the Turtles Paradise. And I think there's another one at the weapon shop too. So that's something. And we get a free elixir. That's nice. Okay. Ba 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 ba. <laughs> so I think this will take us to an item shop, but I don't I don't think there's anything really special going on in there. Yep, yeah, there's a uh, kind of a 
a, a barricade here right now. It, it, it only opens on uh, the second part of the game. And there's some items to get back there, so make sure you keep that in mind. It closes again at the end, but, you know. Hello, looking for anything in particular? They're just some items. Not really a big deal. You don't need any of that nonsense. Plus, we need to save all the money we can, because we got to farm for money to buy all the equipment. And that's going to be fun. It's going to be a good time. You know what I'm talking about? Here is where I was... I mean, this is my hometown. My tribe were protectors of those who appreciate this beautiful canyon in the planet. My brave mother fought and died here, but my cowardly father left her. I am the last of my race. Cowardly father? Yes, my father was a wastrel. And so the mission I inherited from my ancestors is to protect this place. My journey ends here. Hey, Nanaki, you're home. Coming, Grandpa. Oh, boy. Let's rest for a bit. There are some things I want to find out about anyway. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. All right. Let's see what's going on in here. So here's the weapon shop, and here's Turtle's Paradise number four. Now hiring. Looking for someone who can stand long hours of boredom. That's pretty much most jobs, I think. For details, contact the Turtle's Paradise. Okay. It's exciting stuff. Bum, bum. Yay! So here's the weapon shop. We're going to need to farm for most of it. But Tiger Lily Arm Shop. Oh, welcome. The people of this canyon hate to compete, so almost everything here are replicas. But that's alright. Some of them you can really use. Alright. So we can get the Butterfly Edge for Cloud. Tiger Fang for Tifa. And we're out of money. So we're going to need to buy the rest of this as well. And we could buy one silver armlet as well, but we need to farm for the rest of it. Let's see. Do you want to equip the Butterfly Edge? It doesn't have double, but, but, but it has an extra material slot and three more attacks, so we'll go for it. Uh, we'll do... Sleeple, I guess. Whatever. Alright. What else we got going on around here? Back here, we got an elder's room. Yeah, this place has a lot of elders. Freaking elderly. Elder Hargo. Where did I put it? I know it's around here. Hmm, he's looking for something. You can't actually find it or anything, but... Yeah. Bum, 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 bum. We can come out here, but there's really nothing to do out here. Plus, you can barely see anything, so it's just like, whatever, man. I don't even know. I think there's a shop around here. Yeah, right here. I'm a titty shop. Guy's lounging on the job. Pretty sure he could get fired for that, but... Um, oh, sir, you forgot your change. Excuse me? Um, yes, I'm coming. Are you here to shop? That's right. No, what's your problem? Oh, is that so? You're here to shop? Yeah. I'm sorry, we hardly ever get any customers. Oh, but I do have confidence in our materia. So he actually has the MP and HP plus materias. The, the HP plus, which we already have, so so it wouldn't be a bad idea to get an, an MP plus if you have the money, which we do not, so. Another thing we're going to have to farm for, although I, I would definitely go for all the equipment first. And here we got a kitchen. Oh man, I'm so busy, I need more help. Mm, complain. <laughs> Generic complaining. Alright, it's good times. How you doing? 
Buchanagan sealed this door shut. How'd he do that? With super glue? Yes, with super glue. That's what it was. Oh boy. Now they're gone. Cloud, this is my grandfather, Bugen. He is incredible. He knows everything. And for some reason, he can float. Nobody knows why. He just can. Oh, ho, ho. I hear that you looked after Nanaki. Nanaki is still a child, you see. Please stop, Grandfather. I'm 48. Ho, ho, ho. Nanaki's tribe has incredible longevity. So you see, his 48 years would only be equivalent to, say, that of a 15 or 16-year-old in human reckoning. That's a shame. 15 or 16? He's quiet and very deep. You thought he was an adult. Grandfather, I want to be an adult. I want to grow up to be able to protect you in the village. Oh, ho, ho, no, Nanaki. You can't stand on your own yet. To do that now would destroy you in the long run. Reaching up into the heavens. Threatening to snatch the very stars from the great city of Midgar. You've seen it, haven't you? Well, that's a bad example. Looking up too much makes you lose perspective. Hmm. When it's time for the planet to die, you'll understand that you know absolutely nothing. When the planet dies... Ho ho ho! It may be tomorrow, or a hundred years from now, but it's not long off. Ho ho! How do you know this? I hear the cries of the planet. That's a shame. The planet's a big crybaby, apparently. What's that? The sounds of the stars in the heavens. While this goes on, planets are born and die. That's too bad. What was that? Ho ho ho! That was a scream from the planets. Didn't you hear it? As if to say, I hurt. I suffer. He's just got a toothache. They have come here on a journey to save the planet. Why don't you show them your apparatus? Ho oh, ho! Why don't you not? Keep that thing in your pants, sir. Sheesh. Ho ho ho! To save the planet. Ho ho ho! But then again, I guess it wouldn't hurt to show him. Please don't. Bugenhagen. Several odd-looking people are here. Uh-oh. The whole place has gotten busy all of a sudden. He brought friends, too. I'll go get them. Okay. Cloud, please call one of them. Only three people can fit in Grandfather's machine. I thought you were going to go get them. <laughs> what the hell? Don't worry, my machine won't run away. Go and invite your friends. Ho ho ho. All right. So we got to go and uh do do do. Can I get on the Can I get on the thing? Thank you. That was so nice of you. So we got to form a party, of course. Do, 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 do. Bum, bum, bum. Though I think, uh, now if you go to certain places, your character, yeah, your characters will actually be in there. Barrett's here. What? <laughs> Alright. I'm pushing the wrong button. Now that's what I'm doing. Alright, make a party. I'm not sure if it'll let us go out and farm for the money yet. 
we may have to see this cutscene first, I don't recall, but... Go ahead and put that tiger fang on. Which has the same materia slots. And it has seven more attacks, so that's nice. That's cool. Nice upgrade there. Alright, let's see if it'll let us leave or not. I'm not sure if it will. No, it won't. Did you get to see Bugenhagen's contraption? If you ha if you haven't yet, you must. Fine. Gotta be a jerk about it. Jeez. These people. Are so pushy, you know? Here I'm just trying to relax, and they're all like, Oh, you gotta go do this, you gotta go do that. You can't leave the farm for money, you gotta go and do this. Oh boy. I'm telling you. It's all a big pain. It's all it is. Ba -ba -ba, da -da 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 -da. Hey, over here. The door's unlocked. Come in. I don't want to. I'm gonna climb up here instead. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah! Of course, there's really nothing up here. It's like a little, little living quarters and such. Not really anything happening. Ba -ba -ba. You can go up there too, which takes you up here, which again doesn't really do anything. I'm pretty sure this is where Bugenhagen hides his hentai, but that's just my theory. Okay. I'm trying to go down. I'm trying to go down, sir. There you go. Thank you. Okay. I guess we can see this. Ho ho ho! It looks like you have them all together. Then let's begin. I'll stand there. Okay, I guess I'll stand here then. And that's what shall happen. Bum bum bum. Ah! We're in outer space, kind of. So pretty. It's just like the real thing. Hmm, yes, pretty good. This is my laboratory. All the workings of space are entered into this 3D holographic system. Hey, a shooting star! Somebody casted Comet! We're at a planetarium, apparently. How cool is that? Whee! I think he almost got hit by one of those asteroids. Uh, I, I'm just waiting for an R-Wing to fly by. Wow, how wonderful. Ho ho ho! Yes, it is something, isn't it? Well, let's get to the subject. Eventually, all humans die. What happens to them after they die? The body decomposes and returns to the planet. That much everyone knows. What about their consciousness, their hearts, and their souls? The soul, too, returns to the planet. And not only those of humans, but everything on this planet. In fact, all living things in the universe are the same. The spirits that return to the planet merge with one another and roam the planet. They roam, converge, and divide becoming a swell called the Life Stream. Not to be confused with the Death Stream. Life Stream. In other words, a path of energy of the souls roaming the planet. Spirit energy is a word that you should never forget. Because that's what makes the spirit bomb. A new life. Children are blessed with spirit energy and are brought into the world. Then the time comes when they die, and once again return to the planet. Of course there are exceptions, but this is the way of the world. 
I've digressed, but you'll understand better if you watch this. Oh, we're going to watch a DVD. That's cool. There's the Earth! It's some random dude. Hey. And he dies, and his spirit returns to the Earth and such. Such is the way of life. And that's the way it was for the whole summer. Spirit energy is the source of life for trees, birds, and humans. And not only living things, it makes it possible to form planets. And if that spirit energy were to disappear... Horrible things would happen. Cities would go into disrepair. Bongo would no longer make sports videos. It'd be crazy. All hope would be lost. These are the basics of the study of planet life. If spirit energy disappears, our planet will die. Ho ho ho! Spirit energy is efficient because it exists within nature. When spirit energy is forcefully extracted and manufactured, it can accomplish its true purpose. You're talking about Mako energy, right? Everyday Mako reactors suck up spirit energy, diminishing it. Spirit energy is compressed in reactors and processed into Mako energy. All living things are beings used up and thrown away. In other words, Mako energy will only destroy the planet. Well, obviously. Uh, a freaking caveman could tell you that. Sheesh! Well, now what? Just hanging out or what? Are we going to watch a movie? What's happening? The story of the planets and those who lived with them. If you want to know more, then you must listen to the words of the elders. Nah, I'd rather not, actually. I'm kind of sick of listening to you altogether. Nanaki, his father's a coward. So that's it. Nanaki's been thinking that all this time. Pretty much. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. So let's get the hell out of here. This, this place smells like poop. I'm pretty much done here. I want to leave. I want to go have some tacos. Do, 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 do. I'm sure they got a Taco Bell around here somewhere. I mean, come on, man. They gotta have a Taco Bell. Right? No, and then they probably only have a Del Taco. And that's just sad. Everybody's hanging out by the fire. Getting their Taco Bell money all together and ready to go. All right, so here you just want to talk to people. How you doing? Want to hang out? Cloud. Bonfires are funny, aren't they? Oh, they're freaking hilarious. I'm telling you. I'm over here raffling about it. They make you remember all sorts of things. You know, Cloud, five years ago... It's nothing. No, forget it. I'm afraid to ask. What is it? It feels like... It feels like you're going far away. I'm going to Taco Bell. What are you talking about? You really, really are you, right? Yeah. Okay, then. Hey, Barrett, what's up, dude? 
Want to hang out? What's the deal, man? Cosmo Canyon. That's where Avalanche was born. I promised my guys someday, when we saved the planet from the Shinra, that we'd all go to Cosmo Canyon and celebrate. Biggs. Wedge. Jesse. Where did it all go wrong? Now they're all gone. Died for the planet. Really? To save the planet? We all... We all hate the Shinra. But is it right to go on? Will they... Will they ever forgive me? I don't man. Right now, I really don't know. But I do know one thing. If there's anything I can do to save the planet, or the people living on it, then I'm going to do it. I don't care if it's for justice or revenge or whatever. I don't give a fuck. Ah, I'm going to do it! I'm going to do it hard! Again! Again! Avalanche is born again! Calm down, Barrett, okay? Just calm yourself. It's going to be okay, I promise. I learned a lot. The elders taught me many things. About the Cetra and the Promised Land. I'm alone. I'm all alone now. I'm forever alone. Nobody likes me. But I'm... We're here for you, right? I know. I know, but... I am the only... Cetra. Does that mean we can't help? Does that mean you don't want to go to Taco Bell with us? Hmm. Hey, Red, what's up, dude? You hanging out? Long ago, when I was still very small, we were all around this flame. No, n never mind. What happened? It's about my parents. When I talk about my mother, I am full of pride and joy. And that's fine. But when I think of my father, my heart is full of anger. You really can't forgive your father. Of course, he left mother for dead. When the G tribe attacked, he ran off by himself, leaving mother and the people of the canyon. What a bastard! Come, Nanaki, there's something you should see. <laughs> the place may be dangerous. Cloud, will you and one other person come with us? Okay. So we, 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 we gotta have red for this next dungeon. So that's exciting. But we're gonna be farming before that. Dangerous? Count me out! Yeah, I'm definitely counting you out. I wonder what he wants to show him. Hmm, maybe it's maturity that's been passed down for generations. Probably not. Where are they going? Bum, bum. Can I go too? All right, well. So let's see. We want to. Uh, uh, we could. We we could put the diamond pin on you, which is what we're gonna do. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, I, I kind of need to take the silver armlet off of you and the sprint shoes as well, and you know, all that fun stuff. Da na na na. Okay. I wonder what he wants to show Red. Okay. Mainly put, put putting Aris on so she can learn her limits. Give you the sprint shoes. You can just exchange your, uh, stuff. Oh, that's the wrong person! What am I doing? I am just a stupid bitch. That's just the way it is. 
No doubt about it. Okay. Uh, well. Okay. So now we, we want to farm for money, which I think we can do now. Yes. 